everybody, it's Amy Ness with Keller Williams Realty and I thought I'd bring you out for the Friday follow-up. Spring has sprung. The bees are buzzing here and there and everywhere and I should know because I've been seeing them out on my showings as well as out running. I've had flower petals and bees and all kinds of things flying around me. And as you can see behind me, the trees are starting to form buds and everything's starting to bloom and look pretty outside. So. I knew you might not be able to make your way out to this home. A lot of times people are working during the day or they've got things at their home they're attending to or they're out with their kids taking care of, having fun in the yard too. But I thought I'd bring you out to this house I've got listed. It's at 18 Canyon Creek over in the landing subdivision here on the south side of Lafayette. And as you can see behind me, I'm starting to give you a sneak peek. It does have a three car garage. And it's in the landing subdivision. It's got four bedrooms. It's got a big loft room upstairs for entertaining and having fun. The current owners use it for an exercise room. So that's kind of nice as well as it's also got a fenced in backyard out back, privacy fence, wonderful neighborhood. There is a community swimming pool that people enjoy. There's tennis courts, there's soccer fields, all kinds of things, not to mention all the different wonderful sidewalks and neighborhood areas to ride your bike or play or just hang out with your neighbors. So what's been going on with me this week, I've been working with a lot of sellers setting up pre-listing consultations and so we've been talking a little bit about the process and a lot of people have a lot of questions about the process. What does it take Amy to get your home listed? What does it take Amy as far as the paperwork goes? What's the process? How long are homes sitting on the market? They're not. Homes are moving pretty darn quick actually. And then I'm also working with a couple of buyers. I've got some that are looking for a home on the south side of Lafayette, anywhere from the price range of 150 up all the way up to 250. And then I've got a couple that is looking for a home that they can flip. So if you know of anybody that's thinking about selling that has one of those type of homes that they'd be interested in selling, let me know. And then as far as running goes, I'm still doing a lot of training. I ran out at McAllister Park over off of 9th Street earlier this week and that's where I got to visit with most of the bugs and they pretty much landed in my eye as I was running around as well. So it's always a good idea to make sure that you have sunglasses on in the springtime if you're out trail running. And I think I might be all of a sudden signing up to run the Carmel Half Marathon tomorrow. I'm supposed to have a training run of 12 miles anyway, so why not just throw myself into a race last minute? So that's what I'll be doing tomorrow morning at 7.30. I'm going there tonight with a friend to go register so that I can get set up for that. And I think that'll be pretty good. I was set to do a training run on West Lafayette side and there's a few stoplights in that here and there so it might be a little bit more fun to be out on a trail in the race atmosphere so i'm looking forward to that i hope you guys are having a wonderful week it's gonna be absolutely beautiful this weekend get outside play walk around a little bit go for a hike enjoy our community there's tons of wonderful things happening right around this time of year there's a botanical gardens you can go for hikes in you can enjoy our wonderful trails on the lafayette side as well as the west lafayette side and I'm so glad we could get together. I hope you guys have a wonderful week. Thanks. Have a good one.